standalone comic book stuff. Hellboy. The Crooked Man. We watched this trailer the other day, Kyle. Um, you know, it's been getting a bit a bit of heat online. I'm the more I thought about this film, the more I'm looking forward to it. And after that trailer, the teaser, let's say. I'm actually really excited for this. I feel like this is gonna be low budget horror. You know, this is which, got... which which is always the best type of horror. It's the yeah. best type of film for for you know it. I've seen loads of horror flicks. I've seen these big budget ones, and you know none of them do it for me. It's always the low budget ones, like Lights yeah. Out, It Follows, which is it's not horror. It's it's horror. It's thriller. It's, it's a suspense bit of in it. It's it's like yeah. Horrible. But yeah, this. I think this looks great from the teaser we've got. I'm actually really excited for this now. Obviously, uh, the uh, creator of Hellboy is, you know, working on this, producing it. The director of Crank. Uh, we've got Black Tom Cassidy himself <laughs> from Deadpool 2 playing Hellboy. I think this looks really fun. I wouldn't say fun. I I'm well, just going to say it looks good. It looks like it could be really good. And, yeah. you know, Hellboy, as of late, has disappointed in 2019. But that was five years ago. Like, that's... It's weird that that was half a decade ago. Yeah. Don't even feel like it. No. I've still yet to watch it. I just as soon as Like, because we was, we was actually planning to go to the cinema yeah. to see it. And it came to the day and it, we were like... I just can't be bothered. Like, I'd, I'd rather not. Yeah, all the reviews it were getting and stuff like that yeah. kind of just uh, turned Bogged us off. Down. Yeah. Turned us off a bit. Um, Which, you know, it's fair. It's like, again, it's, you know, if the film, say, came out now and, you know, we wouldn't talk about it because we didn't go see it. We'd just say reason why and that's it. Yeah. Now, look, this film's coming out Alumni's little tablet. It did say this year in the trailer, didn't it? Uh, I'm, sh I think so. Yeah, double check. Yeah, yeah, 2024. For some reason, it says on Google uh, October fourth, 2025. Let's look into it a bit more. Boom, 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 boom. October fourth. So this is coming out on October fourth. 2024. Mm. So this year, uh, let's see if we can find a budget. Because I'm really interested to see what they made this for. 20 million, 20 to 25 million. Isn't that the budget for the Five Nights at Freddy's film that yeah. came out? And that did really, really well. Oh yeah, I don't, I, I don't think this will flop. I definitely think this will be somewhat successful. You know, if they release it in October, obviously it's got that yeah. Halloween vibe. And, you know, when you watch this trailer, it doesn't give off that this is your typical superhero film, which, you know, Hellboy, the, the 2019 version, definitely kind of gave off. It was this... Yeah, they were chasing that superhero audience, weren't they? Uh, yeah, just looking at Hellboy from 2019, work. this had a budget of 50 million, so they've slashed the budget in half. Yeah. But it doesn't look like they've got big CGI monsters in this or all like that. Yeah, or over the, over the yeah. top action. Yeah, yeah. But they, I mean, going through I'll now, say... uh, Golden Army had an $85 million budget. And I believe that leaves the original at a $40 million budget. So this is the lowest budget Hellboy film we've ever got as well. Mm. Which for that the makeup actually looks really good. Simple, yeah, I mean, simple and to the point. Yeah, it's you know I know people are going to be like, oh, but what about you know, bring back Roll Perm? And it's like we had that we had Hellboy one, which is a good film, I think. But the Golden Army is definitely far superior. You bet. You prefer Golden Army, yeah? Oh, by a lot. Yeah. Yeah, I'd have to go back and rewatch them, but I'm pretty sure I prefer Golden Army as well. Yeah. 
No one prefers the 2019. No one's even seen it. (laughs) But what we do say about the 2019 is that Hot Toy is so goddamn good. It is. It's such a shame that the film sucks because it's like... That figure looks awesome, but kind of need that emotional connection there to want it and i i i know i going off topic a little bit here but obviously i want to get the um morbius hot toy even though you know that film is a fucking disaster yeah but at the same time it's like oh it's i did i do have some funny memories going in and watching that at the cinema and the time period with all the memes and everything so I'd, i'd get it for that i'd get it for the meme for the meme yeah all that being said, I hope we get a hot toy for this one. If it's good. Looks like it's going to be good. Looks like it, they're taking it back a bit as well in the time period. Um, I've just been looking up on the comic this is based off. Some gnarly shit. Some gnarly horror shit. So. Hell yeah. I can't wait. This looks like I think, it's going to I think that's what the Hellboy n- needs. The franchise yes. definitely needs if it wants to be here and staying because you can't make it a superhero flick it especially in this day and age it works with the uh, game of Toro ones you know these big action flicks but there's so much competition out there for that now and not everyone's game of del toro but you take something like this stick as close to the source material as you can you've got the creator of the character himself producing on this making sure it stays in line you know the crank directors they made a fun film. They made a fun film. We've never seen it. Oh, you're a crank. But anyway, Kyle, should we get to the meat and taties of this episode? The thing we've meat been... And... Meat <laughs> and taties. We've been dying to talk about. we have called the episode this. Wow, wasn't that a great video? Would you agree, Kyle? Yes, you should definitely give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed. We are now late night TV talk show hosts who say subscribe to our channel after video because we are cool. Oh, fuck yeah, that's kind of what we're doing, aren't we? Shut up, mate, just commit to it. Oh, no. Oh, but don't commit, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Right, thanks yeah. for watching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>